morning, good morning to you all. Hi everybody, new people and my followers. Thank you so much for stopping by. This is Connie Murphy, over 70 and still glamorous. Guess what I'm doing today? I'm going to see the movie that I had been anticipating for quite a while now, Dumbo. And I'm gonna go with my twin and her oldest daughter, Alice. So I'm really looking forward to that. Now, my makeup look today, no, I haven't taken my, or did I? No, I haven't taken my top, my tape off yet, but I will before I leave. Uh, so for more fun, my foundation today, after my uh, argan oil and my alame over my clean skin from last night. Didn't wash my face this morning again. I never do. Uh, then I mixed my True Match, which is a natural buff, N3. And I wanted to have a little more coverage, so I mixed it with my CoverGirl Olay. And that worked out really good. 28 uh, broad spectrum, by the way. And then just for a pinch of softness, I threw in my new Fit Stick. It's very, very creamy, and if you put it on by itself, you have a little coverage, but it's more of a natural kind of see-through look. Okay, for my blush, my e.l.f., which is called Bright Pink, and I use a little brush here. And then afterwards, I'll blend it out, put it wherever else I want it. Okay, on my eyes. As you know, I line them. Well, no, take that back. Take that back. Today, I put on my false eyelashes again. So uh, I put my eyelashes on first with no makeup there. Maybe a little powder or something just to make them stick. And then I take my liquid eyeliner. Here it is. And I go to the very bottom of my lash and go up. Same on the other side. And on the inside corner I lay it down and then I just barely go over the false eyelashes. Then since I have a little more brown in my eyebrows I took my uh, brown pencil and went underneath and went followed the original uh, eyeliner that I put on there and then I took my light powder to set the uh, eyebrow pencil under there. On the top, today for the first time, I used a little angle brush to do my crease because that way I didn't get too much color going where I didn't want it yet. So I used an angle brush for that. I also use the ankle brush to tap in the uh, light brown powder under my eyes. And then afterwards, this is the light brown color that I use to tap under the bottom. And then I put this on with my brush directly down and put it on my brow bone. As far as my lip tip goes, you know I love my show and tell matte stain. I just dropped my uh, lip pencil. And my favorite NYX pink color lipstick. Now it's pretty low, so I've been using those little uh, tweezers that come in the eyebrow kits to just grab it and put it on. Let me get my lip liner. And here it is. I lip line after I do the other two applications. And so that's it. Don't have uh, much more to share with you at this moment. I'll try and come back to you uh, when I get out of the movies. We'll see what happens. Oh, I forgot to tell you about my eyebrows. Well, you know I always use the eyebrow uh, palette 
from LA Colors. I believe I bought this at the Walmart. So uh, I used a little brush, medium brown today. I'll, I'll do this slowly again because people ask me about this all the time. I don't start applying till after I hit, oh, we'll say uh, about the middle of the pupil and I go straight up. Now, they'll end up being a little wing, but I don't worry about that because when I'm done, I'll just take it down. So then the next step I do, get some more powder and go straight down and I follow my hairline. And my hairline doesn't go out and doesn't go around. It goes straight down. Then with the residual, I'll fill in a little bit in here and just make sure it's all even. Same thing on the other side. And because I want to emphasize the arch, I'll go with a, my Maybelline eyebrow pencil. And where there are less hair starts, which is about the middle of the pupil, I'll fill in a little bit there and go straight down. And make it a little bit longer because for some reason the ends always disappear. So that's my eyebrows. Oh, another thing I forgot. I added one little extension here and one little extension here, uh, right there. So just above the temples. Sometimes I'll put two on this side and then the second one I will put at the temple. And then because my hair is getting thinner, I actually didn't see it early enough. I put a little black eyeshadow there and then I spray it down just to cover up the thing. I don't need the kabuki stuff. Okay, and I took two little ones, uh, extensions, and I just took a little bit of hair up and I put one here and one there because the hair separates now. It does to everybody after a certain age. So that's what I did. And let me get a mirror. So, I've got one here, and I've got one there. Okie dokie. That's it. <laughs> All right. There you have it. And for my lunch today, I'll show you. And I eat turkey dogs with broken beans. This is the can of Progresso chicken noodle soup that I just take the noodles and the carrots out of. And that's a meal. <laughs> and for any of you new gals that are first time watchers or viewers, I always clean my brushes like this. After every use, I clean each one and then I only have to tear off the little section that I used. Yeah, okay. Hi girls, on my way home, but I'm stopping right here at McDonald's to get two double cheeseburgers that I put lettuce on tomato when I get home and uh, two vanilla shakes and four french fries. Two for my hubby. <laughs> the movie was fantastic, I really enjoyed it. So just wanna say goodbye for, day, for today and I hope to see you soon. Love you all, Mwah. Take care, mama.